Hi, welcome back to Wallflowers. So today, being Thursday, it's haul day. So let's get straight to it. The first initiative that I went to today, um, I managed to get two different types of lettuces um, for all the salads we're going to be eating at the moment. Nice bag of limes, three large potatoes, some sugar snaps, carrots, salad potatoes. Um, so all that in the bag cost me a pound. Um, bin liners as usual uh, for a pound. And um, Oxo uh, cubes for 50 pence. So we've got one pound, two pound, um, two pound fifty. I think the lessons were actually free. So oh, and a bag of ham, bag of shredded ham, and they are portion up and freeze. Um, so that'll last us for sandwiches, salads, etc. Maybe a couple of meals. How much is it? Um. So there's actually heavy smoked Wilshire ham buttons, um, it doesn't actually tell me how much is in it. Do not freeze. No, it store in the freezer. Oh, do not refreeze. So, um, one, two. Three, three pound fifty, and the lettuces were free. So that's shop one, three pound fifty. We we'll move on to shop two. So the next shop, um, I managed to get some tea lights, two packs of the small Ziploc bags. Um, Fine. So I got picked up two packs of those. A hair dye. Um, ben and man, these are all just one pounds each. Um, and some peacock orchids. So with them being bulbs, they'll come back every year. Um, and I quite like the look of them. Um, <laughs> funny story behind this. This is an eye mask. And when Mr. Wallflowers has his afternoon snooze after work, um, he started to borrow my eye mask, a black eye mask. And he claimed it and I never got it back. So sometimes if I'm tired and I want to snooze in the afternoon, I don't have an eye mask because Mr. Wallflowers has claimed it. So I found one today. Um, this is my one and it's actually got earbuds in it as well so we've both got an eye mask each now which is really good and that's why I purchased that and the free gift today was some um, fabric softener just a sample packet so we got that as a bonus so the price here was one two three four five six six pounds so I've got 40 Ziploc bags, I've got 20 tea lights, an eye mask, some flowers that will come back year after year, um, and a free sample of softener. And a hair dye. And a hair dye. So one, two, three, four, five, six pounds. And that's the Hamlet. So I'll now bring up the next store. So the next shop is the edge and normally I get 12 items for four pounds um, and they've now dramatically changed it to a sticker system which I started to mention last week so the celebrations were a three sticker um, tins of pork were a two sticker so that becomes five seven items the washing up liquid was a two sticker, so that becomes nine items. And then I got these, and I paid £4.80 altogether for everything I have. So, um, because I've gone two items 
over the 12. So we have 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. These become the foot two more, which is 14 items. So for the next items, you pay 40 pence per extra item. So it worked out quite well for me. I literally got everything I wanted to get. So this is a balsamic red onion relish. Uh, Mr. Wallflowers will enjoy that. This is a smoky tomato ketchup. Um, and we can use that for burgers, hot dogs, um, anything that we just want a twist of a smokiness to. Um, some different tea bags for Mr. Wallflowers today. And they're actually called a Schwarzer tea bag. Now, we've not come across that before. And when I asked the gentleman in the shop, he said they're very much like a Thai food tea bag. So I knew they'd be all right for Mr. Wallflowers. The lemons again. Um, of late, we're actually using them in our Moringa tea. Um, so they'll come in very useful. And a heavily discounted Warburton's loaf that we get just for 33 pence. So, or unless we're paying it as an extra item, it becomes 40 pence. But, um, so, yeah, a treat for the weekend for Mr. Wallflowers and I to share. Two items for the pantry, extra washing up liquid for the pantry store. Treats for salads and barbecues in the garden. Tea bags for Mr. Wallflowers. Lemons for our moringa and bread for daily use. So those items are absolutely wonderful. And as I say, that cost me four pounds eighty. But on the free table at the shop today was a couple of pans. And this is a really heavy stoneware pan. Um, and I just thought, yeah, that's wonderful. I'm going to have that. Um, so I picked it up. Unfortunately, there was no lid with it. Now, there's a funny story with this. So as we progress to the next shop, I'll bring this pan out and show you what the connection is to the to the funny story. Um, but yeah, what a wonderful free gift. It's absolutely rotten. I've got it all over my top and all over my hands because I keep playing with it. But I'll give it a good clean. Um, I'm really happy with that pan, especially as it was a free gift as well. And it's really heavy. So for four pounds eighty to actually get everything there, including the pan, I think that's absolutely wonderful. Okay, I'll bring the next shop up for you next. And the next shop, um, Fair Clempt, I got a hobus loaf which will go straight in the freezer. Um, a sausage casserole just for fifty pence. Um, some nice cheesecakes that will be dessert for myself during the week. A nice treat. And these are two yogurt based coleslaws. Uh, they will be nice along with our salads or our sandwiches in this nice weather. I got two ciabattas and two crispy rolls, which will be delicious. A nice green pepper and some cavalonero, um, lots of iron and lots of folate in that. So, along with my health kick of trying to have lots of leafy greens and a bit more iron um, and folate, this bread um, and the cavalonero uh, will be absolutely wonderful for that. So let me work out how much I've spent here. So it's a pound for the cheesecakes, 50 pence for the sausage casseroles, one pound 50, 50 pence for the vegetables, because I only got two. Um, so that's two pound and 25 pence for the two lots of the coleslaw, which is fabulous. So, and the bread was free, of course. So what's that, two pound 25? Um, for everything you see there, so absolutely wonderful. I'll show you the next shop. So, the next shop, um, we got some cheesy soft, cheesy cheese and onion rolls, um, for just 50 pence, and um, some chicken. So, it's KFC chicken in the bags with the cooking instructions. 
um, that was just a pound. Um, super green salad, so in it is a mix of cucumber, adami, apple and sugar snaps with a fruity ginger dressing. And that would be delicious and good for me at the moment. So I'll eat that one and Mr. Wallflowers and I will have one each of these. So it's Italian panna, Italian pasta and spinach salad with Italian egg pasta in a fragrant pesto dressing topped with pine kernels. That looks absolutely delicious. So they were actually free um, because they had to go today um, and they were in the free trolley. So I picked them up and thought, yeah, they'll be wonderful. Paid £1.50 for the chicken and the cheese rolls. And what was absolutely amazing um, was at the side, it's really heavy, heavy for me to pick up, was this stoneware, really heavy um, set. So not only was it the, the bottom one, I'm struggling to pick these up. There's a big one. Now this one needs cleaning inside. Um, and that one's got a lid to it. Then there's the second one, but well, third actually, but the second saucepan, and the lid fits that. So that set actually cost me five pounds. Um, I decided to treat myself and thought that was absolutely wonderful. Um, what was so strange was that was the free one. That was actually in a completely different food initiative today and was completely free. But what is spectacular is it's the next level pan and it actually fits inside and becomes a four piece set. Yes, the handle is slightly different colour. Um, but to me, they're all part of the same set, set. Absolutely wonderful. There's no difference in them other than the handle. Absolutely amazing. So I'm really, really happy with them. So one was free and the rest of the set cost me £5. They're quite mucky in the cleaning up. They've probably been stored in somebody's garage or garden shed, whatever. Uh, for quite a while, but yeah, an amazing set that cost me five pounds and one was free. So, what if I spend five, six, six pounds fifty for everything you see there? An amazing set and some goodies to bring out for food. Absolutely wonderful. So, as normal, I'll bring everything together and give you a total of what I've spent. Okay, so everything is up on the side. So let me talk you through it. So we've got three free salads or pastas, um, some yogurt coleslaw, um, some big bag of KFC chicken, some washing up liquid, a nice large bag of ham pieces, some bin liners, some flower bulbs that will come back year after year, some beautiful Cavallonero, some candles, um, tea lights, some cheese and onion rolls, a hairdo, two, sorry, yeah, a hair, hair dye, sorry, <laughs> <laughs> two tan cans of chopped pork um, that would be really useful either for sandwiches or a pantry stocker and come out if and when we need them. Some tea bags for Mr. Wallflowers. Three nice cheesecake desserts for myself. Two boxes of Ziploc bags. So that's 40 of them, albeit small ones. Nice bag of limes that we can use to flavour our salads, our drinks, absolutely anything at all. An eye mask, so I've finally got my own. <laughs> Some nice salad potatoes. 
lovely sugar snappies, some nice carrots, pepper, lemons, large potatoes, two different types of lettuces, a fancy ketchup um, to use in the garden or just if we fancy, <coughs> a nice sausage casserole, some nice balsamic red onion relish for burgers, hot dogs, etc. Some oxo cubes. Two loaves, a big treat of celebrations for the weekend, and a fabulous pan set that's oldie worldy, absolutely solid, really heavy bottom pans, absolutely amazing. So, for everything you see before me, I've paid a total of £23.55. pence. Um, and that's one of my more expensive shops that I've done in a long while but if you actually take into consideration I've paid five pounds for this fabulous set if you took that off the shopping would have come to 18 pounds that's still a lot for me really and as you can see it's not spreading down the counters as long as it used to but we still have quite a sufficient amount of different items mostly food some kitchenware some plants some softener an eye patch and the rest is literally all food but we've got some bags as well but even for that price i'm still really happy with the prices at the food initiative some what i managed to get so yeah 23 pounds less in my pocket but an abundance of different things that i wouldn't have had so yeah Blessed, blessed again, yeah, and these have just brought an instant smile to my face, so yeah, truly blessed. I'll give them a good scrub, work out what I'd like to use them for, um, probably try and work out how I can display them as well in the kitchen as a decorative thing uh, whilst they're not in use. Okay, hope you enjoy seeing what I got because I enjoy showing you all. Um, thanks for joining us today and we'll speak to you again soon. Bye bye.